with my experiment that I conducted this year, I actually wanted to see the effects that different drugs are used in cancers. And so I took a chemical that's often used um, to treat different types of bone cancers and breast cancers. And I used another one that's used in combination with radiation therapy. Well, it's actually never been done before. Yeah, Ashton works really hard. Super dedicated, solves problems. We've had some very generous donors, uh, more recently through the Chehalis Foundation. We have a lot of cool laboratory opportunities here that are typically not available in high school, including like pipetters for measuring small liquid, volumes of liquid, to our real-time PCR machine here is one of our more advanced pieces of equipment. Which, um, which is incredible because not many high school students can say that they worked with this machine, and so it's a great opportunity to be able to say when I apply to colleges, when I want to work in a lab, that I've worked with this machine. So the Intel International Science and Engineering Fair is the largest pre-college science fair in the world. I was the only person in my entire category to work in a high school lab. Well, I was pretty excited uh, and I got to go with, so I was even more excited about that. <laughs> I actually met the head admissions officer at MIT and he advised me to apply next year. I definitely want to continue um, cell biology and molecular genetics in college and possibly biomedicine engineering. WFOS programs have helped me narrow down what I want to do in college. Thank you.